your back. No. How did you get on? Not so good, Vera. It's harder every day. Look at these mushrooms. Hmm. We tried all the usual places, even some new ones. But there's nothing better to be had. Not enough damp anymore. Not enough shade. Sometimes I even think that the trees are losing their leaves. Oh, that's our Paul. Always merry and bright. Look at my cabbages. They're coming along just fine. <laughs> He'll be here shortly. Now, look, Beth. If he's me... Oh, he's you, all right, I know. I've got the scars to prove it. But if he really is me, then how come he isn't called Simon anymore? Why's he just got a number? 2957. Controller 2957. Exactly a number. Now, who wants a number instead of a name? Controller 2957. Controller 2956. Or that choosy controller 2955. <laughs> what I don't understand is why you laugh so much. Well, the other Beth was angry at me. What other Beth? Try and get hold of it. We saw you in another projection. There was this laboratory in the Antarctic, and you were a scientist. Never. You were. Look, me as a crazy poet, all right, Liz. Me as a beat-up schoolmarm, fine. But me as a scientist, not on your life. And what's wrong with being a scientist? Would you like to see the scars, Simon? I usually charge a small fee. Oh, look, Beth, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> no, Beth, you're not making sense. Liz, dear, have you ever heard that when people laugh a lot at things, it's because they might cry if they didn't? Yes. And I need to say no more. Surely. <laughs> Outsiders, quick! Hey, what the... oh, Don't dear. try anything. Paul, dear, do you have to be so earnest? They may be outsiders, but that doesn't mean to say they're not friends. Joking me! Shut up. We can't take any chances here. Where did they come from? They're Liz and Simon, my friends. They just wandered into the compound, Paul. I thought they must be misfits looking for somewhere to stay. Misfits? The community can't take on any more members. There isn't enough food to go around as it is. Paul. Beth, there isn't. Sometimes I don't think you know how bad things are. I can't believe you. Shut up. Are you misfits pushed out of a cleared sector, maybe? No, I mean... Well, I don't know which we well, are... delocalised because of a naturally devastated terrain, then. They just don't carry any social registration, that's all, Vera. We needn't go into it deeper for the moment. <coughs> Paul, dear, do you think you could release Simon? It's perfectly splendid of you to be so concerned for our security. But he's going purple. <laughs> children have nowhere else to live there. No, Liz. That's why they're called misfits. So I founded this community especially to look after them. Well, how come they've got nowhere else to go then? Well, the fact is they've just been left over, Simon. When different areas of the country have been cleared for geographical reconstruction or because of a nasty technological mistake, somewhere has become uninhabitable. Like Liverpool, say. Liverpool, uninhabitable. The authorities make no provision for misfits, so people like me have to do the best they can. There's um, quite a lot going on in the way of this geographical reconstruction in England, then. Oh, well, of course, Simon, you wouldn't know anything about that. Look, this is the age of scientific advancement. The technocracy rules us, and progress comes before everything. We're going in for bigger and better industry, more machines, more mechanical people and... Oh, what on earth is that? What was that? 
Thunder. That was thunder? I told you everything was bigger and better in the age of scientific advancement, didn't I? Who... Who are you? I haven't seen you before, have I? You're... You, you're Controller 2957. That's correct. But you, for a moment, I Why thought that... Controller? Lurking in the bushes like a misfit on the run. Beth, I, I wanted to speak to you, but there were a lot of people about. You know how dangerous it is for me to come here anyway. Oh, yes. Heaven knows what they'd say in the big city if they heard you'd been seen talking to a social outcast like me. I see you've met our newest arrival, young Simon. What name did you say? Simon. Why, that's And this is his little friend, Liz. But that's impossible. You're not expecting I me to believe that... I beg your pardon, that... Controller. What am I not expecting you to believe? Fearfully hot. Hotter than it was yesterday, but probably not as hot as it will be tomorrow. I wasn't intending a criticism. The overall European plan allows for a rise in temperature to 100 degrees over the British Isles during geographical reconstruction. Later, we shall return to a steady 60. Bully for the Ministry of Forward Development. I'm not here to talk about all that anyway. I merely came to help you again if I can. I don't recall ever asking for any help. No, you... No, you didn't. But you take such awful chances, Beth. This community is illegal. You could get into terrible trouble if you found running it. That puts an obligation on me. I, I owe you something. I, I mean, for old time's sake. I, uh, I, I brought you this. It's a license. A which? A license for the community. Well, don't ask me how I got hold of it. Just take it. You've only to present it should you be discovered at any time, and the blame for your existence comes right back to the Ministry. To you? Oh, good Lord, no. I can't afford to be involved. To the department as a whole. The central computer. An administrative error. I see. We. I. Are. Am. An administrative error. And you, out of the kindness of your heart, want to help me for old time's sake. Well, this, dear 2957, is what you can do with your help. Beth, what are you doing? Have you gone mad? Really, Beth, after he's gone to the Keep trouble. out of it, Simon. This is an official document. Yes, you shut up, Simon. Beth is right. He's not risking his precious skin. It's all talk with you, isn't it, Simon? Liz! Hunters again. Closer. Who are they? What are they hunting? I mustn't be found here. It would be disastrous. Beth, please. Action stations, everyone. Plan oh, three. Please. Quickly. Oh, oh, oh. Hurry. Come on. Come on. Don't worry, Controller. We'll protect you now you're here. We don't mind who we save from the technocrats. hunting. Wildlife, of course. Oh, pheasants and that, you mean, for food? Oh, goodness me, no sports out these days. Food is created scientifically. Wildlife is considered a nuisance. So every now and again, the authorities send out hunters to keep the bird population down. But that's awful. <laughs> no, it's progress, Liz. Ask 2957. Some more fish, Liz. Beth? No, thanks. No. Better dig in while you can. We might not be having many more protein meals shortly. Paul. But there'll always be fish in the rivers, won't there? Not if the technocracy has its way. The pollution's even creeping into the little side streams we use now. In about a year, there won't be a fish left in the British Isles. He's joking, isn't he? Oh, with all the gay abandon of the year 1990. This is really a killingly funny time we live in, Liz. Ask 2957. Well, how did it all happen? How did what happen? Well, England becoming a hot country in that. 
You're pretty ill-informed, aren't you? Oh, I know the general theory. It's the but... educational system, of course. The schools simply don't explain the master plan properly. The master plan? Yes. What's that? Are you joking? No, I only... Everybody knows something about the master plan. It's our road to technological efficiency. Ever since the Russians melted their section of the polar ice caps, we've been able to change the face of Europe. Recite cities, divert rivers, extend trade. The critics complain about accidents. Well, it was a shame about what happened to Liverpool, I suppose. But on the other hand, with a majority of exports coped with by air freight, who needs a place like that above water anyway? Why do you have a number instead of a name? It should be safe enough for me to start back now. Look, I want to know. See here, who are you anyway? In a computerized society, surely it's obvious that digital designation... <laughs> Where did he come from? What did he see? Well, now do you understand? Beth, for pity's sake, you live on a razor's edge! You're only frightened for yourself. You don't care about me. <sighs> 362, a delta. Well, that's lucky. Now, here's what you do. Dump him somewhere else in the jungle. He probably won't remember much in the morning. I'll put in a central computer order and have him transferred to Scotland, first thing. Quickly! Come on. Well, I hope you're satisfied. You're outside society, Beth. Outside the course of history. Is that what you really want of life? Things have changed since we were young, you know. It's a different world. Better organized. M no, wait. I me, Simon. This is a ridiculous situation for a man in my position. I am controller after all. What does that mean? In the Ministry of Forward Development. I have responsibility for an entire sector of geographical reconstruction. Beth. What's the matter with Beth? Why does she want to live in a place like this? Jungle. Primitive. Unhygienic. Natural. You've uh, known Beth a long time, haven't you? E ever since she was Liz. Well, it was what I wanted to talk to you about. You said None of your business. But it is. You know my name's Simon. Would it help if I told you my other name was... No. What? Don't say it. Why not? Because it's more than any man in my position should have to cope with. It's got nothing to do with geographical reconstruction. And how on earth do you suppose we'd ever get a permit for it? There we are. Uh, all right, Vera, dear? Yes, sir? I think it was just a bit of a shock, that's so. all. <laughs> Eat up. Beth? Yes? You really like 2957, don't you? What did you say? Deep down, I mean. How in the world can you like someone who's doing everything they possibly can to destroy you? But he isn't. That license he brought you wasn't much, maybe, but he did it because that he... That was a sham. I thought you weren't taken in by it. Look, he said what he really felt before he left. He thinks of me as something stubborn. Old-fashioned. A survival from another age. <laughs> well, maybe I am. But he's something worse. It's a new world. And I'm the enemy of that. And he, if he only knew, helped to make me one. Oh, I suspected it, of course. I'm not a fool. But to think that it's true. 
master plan has nothing to say on the subject of time phases and messing about with a barrier. Well, this master plan seems pretty important to you. Of course, Simon. By the time we're finished, we shall have remade the world. It'll be as splendid and efficient as a great machine. Perfect, without fault. But I still don't see why... Well? Well, you. You're like me in a lot of ways, but in others... One serves, Simon. One serves. But serves what? But don't you understand? Science is more than a meal ticket for industrialists, which is about all it amounted to in your day. Now science is the direction of the human race. The present and the future. The norm. Very well. You shall see if you don't believe me. I don't care what the risks are, you shall see. Here, on the edge of the jungle, tomorrow morning, Simon, I'll pick you up by hovercraft and take you to my office in the Ministry. All right? You must understand, you know. You, of all people. Yes. Well, the old place has changed a bit. <laughs> Thank goodness, Simon. Still that queer fun. Morning, controller. Oh, morning. Why, you're... I beg your pardon. Uh, Alpha 16, Simon. A possible new recruit to the sector, Alpha 16, uh, from the north. Oh, well, another country boy comes to town, eh? We shall have to call ourselves the Ministry of Rural Expansion if this goes on. But that's just like a lady I used to know once. Called Miss Stebbins. No, no. Alpha 16. And this is your office? That's right. Room 209? Mm-hmm. Ah, controller. I've just been collating your computer instructions for the morning. Nothing urgent. Save a bit of pressure over the section of the Atlantic Sea Curtain we're responsible for. That's still reading Amber. I thought we'd given them the go-ahead. Oh, uh, this is Simon, a young man interested in our work here. Alpha 17. 17? You blood, eh? Well, we can always do with that, provided it's suitably blue, of course. Oh, Contrella, I should have told you that a report came in from temperature records early. Apparently, it was 100 plus in Eastbourne yesterday. Nice for the bathers. Yes, but hardly in accord with the master plan. Oh, uh, no doubt one of those freak variations, Alpha 16. Uh, we only have general surveillance over all that anyway. I'll check it out. Just as you say, Contrella. I was just thinking of popping along for some tea, 16. Tea? I say that's not a bad idea. Begins to feel like tea time when one's been at work fully 20 minutes. Uh, 25. Shall we pop together then? You pop and I'll follow. Those two, they're exactly alike. Yes, perfect secretaries. Oh, there's still a lot I don't get around here. Oh, I realise some things must have changed since the last time I came, but... When were you ever here before? Well, you know, that day we... I came up from Lizzie's place. Oh, Simon. Oh, we came to see Commander Training Room Don't to... Don't mention that name here. Well, I, I brought you here to give you some idea of our plan as a whole, didn't I? This way. Now, these are the new conurbations. London... Cardiff, Manchester, Glasgow, Belfast. Eventually, the whole populace will live in these conurbations. Everybody? Oh, it makes economic sense. Communications. Now, we've cleared wasteful living space so we can construct fast, efficient throughways like these, you see? Geographical reconstruction. Now, this is carried out in accordance with the overall European plan and allows us to divert rivers, recite lakes, just as we choose. We can even move mountains if we want to. The Atlantic Sea Curtain. Now, this is to hold back water pumped from our latitudes into the Southern Ocean. Water pumped into the Southern Ocean? Now, why does that have to be done? Well, ever since the melting of the polar ice caps, we've had something of a flooding problem. We've gained a climate suitable for technological development, but on the other hand, we... I beg your pardon, Controller. I didn't realise you were engaged. Oh, uh, come in. Uh, come in, Alpha 4. A young friend, Simon. 
Old-fashioned nomenclature, unusual. He hasn't social registration as yet, applying for controller status. I simply wanted a word with you about this Atlantic Sea Curtain section. Uh, Alpha Four is my second in command, Simon. It seems the synthetic rubber sheeting for the next stage hasn't been manufactured as required. But as soon as the seabed cable was laid, I gave orders to the factories to start producing it. Have you checked with the Central Computer Instruction Bank? Yes. No record. How's that possible? I tell you, I authorize commencement. Curiouser and curiouser. Of course, I would have cleared it up with you yesterday afternoon, but you weren't here in your office. No. Off gallivanting and hadn't left anywhere you could be contacted. Either. I was on special business yesterday afternoon. Very well, Alpha 4, I'll clear up the mystery. I hope so. We've contracted to have our section of the curtain completed by the new year. I'm aware of that. The Americans are already well ahead with theirs. Yes. Thank you, Alpha 4. Now, he's called Alpha like all the others. What? Well, last time it was Alpha 4, Alpha 16, Alpha 17, now Alpha 4. Yes, that's correct. Well, how come they're called Alphas? Oh, Simon, don't bother yourself with things like that. Well, look, I'm only trying to find things out. Yes, yes, I, I know, but in this case, you wouldn't understand. And why not? You simply wouldn't. It has nothing to do with a master plan. Alphas are just rather special people in our society. If it makes you any the wiser, they're what are called clones. Now, this is the central computer for the master plan, Simon. All information is correlated here. Each separate department feeds in its instructions and requirements, and then we... Terribly sorry to disturb you again, Controller, but now it seems there's some trouble about the seabed cable. What trouble? That's all finished with. Afraid not. It's all right, strange. I'll be right over. What's wrong? Look, Simon, um, look around by yourself for a few minutes, will you? I'll, I'll be back. We, I, are, am an administrative error, and you, out of the kindness of your heart, want to help me for old time's sake. Well, this, dear 2957, is what you can do with your help. Beth, what are you doing? Have you gone mad? Really, Beth, after she's gone to the Keep out of it, Simon. This is an official document. Yes, you shut up, Simon. Beth is right. He's not risking his precious skin. It's all talk with you, isn't it, Simon? Liz! Hunters again. Closer. I mustn't be found here. It would be disastrous. Beth, please. Action stations, everyone. Plan oh, three. Quickly. Hurry. Oh, oh, hurry. Oh, 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 Come on. Oh. Don't worry, controller. We'll protect you now you're here. We don't mind who we save from the technocrats. I still don't 
know what they're hunting. Wildlife, of course. Oh, pheasants and that, you mean, for food? Oh, goodness me, no sports out these days. Food is created scientifically. Wildlife is considered a nuisance. So every now and again, the authorities send out hunters to keep the bird population down. But that's awful. No, it's progress, Liz. Ask 2957. Some more fish, Liz. Beth? No, thanks. No. Better dig in while you can. We might not be having many more protein meals shortly. Paul. But there'll always be fish in the rivers, won't there? Not if the technocracy has its way. The pollution's even creeping into the little side streams we use now. In about a year, there won't be a fish left in the British Isles. He's joking, isn't he? Oh, with all the get Trailer. Lurking in the bushes like a misfit on the run. Beth, I, I wanted to speak to you, but there were a lot of people about. You know how dangerous it is for me to come here anyway. Oh, yes. Heaven knows what they'd say in the big city if they heard you'd been seen talking to a social outcast like me. I see you've met our newest arrival, young Simon. What name did you say? Simon. Why, that's And this is his little friend, Liz. But that's impossible. You're not expecting I me to believe that... I beg your pardon, that... Controller. What am I not expecting you to believe? Fearfully hot. Hotter than it was yesterday, but probably not as hot as it will be tomorrow. I wasn't intending a criticism. The overall European plan allows for a rise in temperature to 100 degrees over the British Isles during geographical reconstruction. Later, we shall return to a steady 60. Fully for the Ministry of Forward Development. I'm not here to talk about all that anyway. I merely came to help you again if I can. I don't recall ever asking for any help. No, you... No, you didn't. But you take such awful chances, Beth. This community is illegal. You could get into terrible trouble if you found running it. That puts an obligation on me. I, I owe you something. I, I mean, for old time's sake. I, uh, I, I brought you this. It's a license. A which? A license for the community. Well, don't ask me how I got hold of it. Just take it. You've only to present it should you be discovered at any time, and the blame for your existence comes right back to the Ministry. To you? Oh, good Lord, no. I can't afford to be involved. To the department as a whole. The central computer. An administrative error. This is a beat-up school, ma'am. Fine. For me as a scientist? Not on your life. And what's wrong with being a scientist? Would you like to see the scars, Simon? I usually charge a small fee. Oh, look, Beth, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> no, Beth, you're not making sense. Liz, dear, have you ever heard that when people laugh a lot at things, it's because they might cry if they didn't? Yes. And I need say no more. Surely. Don't try anything. Paul, dear, do you have to be so earnest? They may be outsiders, but that doesn't mean to say they're not friends. Joking me. Shut up. We can't take any chances here. Where did they come from? They're Liz and Simon, my friends. They just wandered into the compound, Paul. I thought they must be misfits looking for somewhere to stay. Misfits? The community can't take on any more members. There isn't enough food to go around as it is. Paul. Beth, there isn't. Sometimes I don't think you know how bad things are. I can't believe. Shut up. Are you misfits? Pushed out of a cleared sector, maybe? No, I mean, well, I don't know which well, is... delocalised because of a naturally devastated terrain, then? They just don't carry any social registration, that's all, Vera. We needn't go into it deeper for the moment. <coughs> Paul, dear, do you think you could release Simon? It's perfectly splendid of you to be so concerned for our security. But he's going purple. <laughs>
Hey, you're back. How did you get on? Not so good, Vera. It's harder every day. Look at these mushrooms. Hmm. We tried all the usual places, even some new ones. But there's nothing better to be had. Not enough damp anymore. Not enough shade. Sometimes I even think that the trees are losing their leaves. Oh, that's our poor, always merry and bright. Look at my cabbages. They're coming along just fine. <laughs> He'll be here shortly. Now, look, Beth. If he's me... Oh, he's you, all right, I know. I've got the scars to prove it. But if he really is me, then how come he isn't called Simon anymore? Why's he just got a number? 2957. Controller 2957. Exactly a number. Now, who wants a number instead of a name? Controller 2957. Controller 2956. Or that choosy controller 2955. <laughs> what I don't understand is why you laugh so much. But the other Beth was angry at me. What other Beth? Try and get hold of it. We saw you in another projection. There was this laboratory in the Antarctic, and you were a scientist. Never. You were. Look, me as a crazy poet, all right, Liz. Me. All these children have nowhere else to live there. No, Liz. That's why they're called misfits. So I founded this community especially to look after them. Well, how come we've got nowhere else to go then? Well, the fact is they've just been left over, Simon. When different areas of the country have been cleared for geographical reconstruction or because of a nasty technological mistake, somewhere has become uninhabitable. Like Liverpool, say. Liverpool? Uninhabitable? The authorities make no provision for misfits, so people like me have to do the best they can. There's, um, quite a lot going on in the way of this geographical reconstruction in England, then. Oh, well, of course, Simon, you wouldn't know anything about that. Look, this is the age of scientific advancement. The technocracy rules us and progress comes before everything. We're going in for bigger and better industry, more machines, more mechanical people and... Oh, what on earth that? Thunder. That was thunder? I told you everything was bigger and better in the age of scientific advancement, didn't I? Who... Who are you? I haven't seen you before, have I? You're... You, you're Controller 2957. That's correct. But you, for a moment, I Why thought... Why 